Jay-Z Tommy. Oh, so he's talking. Steven Sprouse. Steven Sprouse. Thank you. It's changed the landscape of fashion. I had this idea to, to kind of deface the monogram and I wanted to do that with graffiti which to me was always a kind of defiant act and a rebellious act and an anarchic act but also something that creates a new surface and a new, a new meaning with something old. So, um, so I, I thought whose hand and whose graffiti would mean something to me and of course I went back to Stephen who had always used graffiti. Stephen Sprouse was always um, a real fixture in New York nightlife and, and in New York City um, as an artist and as a fashion designer and as a personality and a presence and um, uh, I, uh, when he started showing his clothes uh, I became very aware of him and his whole entourage which included Stephen Mizell, Terry Toy, Debbie Harry, etc. Et he elevated the idea of what was street wear into something that was considered high fashion. He worked in the finest fabrics, had beautiful quality workmanship and he did things that were not based on cost or commerciality. He did things that were based on pure aesthetic and an expression of an idea. I did my best in a very first degree way to imitate what I think Stephen would have done or has done in terms of fashion and you know so I took very basic pieces like the Balmacan that he always loved and we put the monogram inside and we put his graffiti over it or we made a little t-shirt dress with a singular you know engineered print in fluorescent colors um, the sneakers or the trainers that look kind of like ski boots like basket sneakers or basketball sneakers uh, ski boots futuristic you know velcro I tried to use the things in Stephen's vocabulary and give it the shape, silhouette, and styling that Stephen would have done when he was at his, the, the top of his game, you know, in terms of fashion and designing. So it really is a complete homage and uh, a complete combination of what is Vuitton and what is this legendary icon and then what are the icons and uh, the lasting aesthetics that Stephen left in the fashion world.